Good morning to you again, and good morning to my <coughs> my 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 very good friend, yeah. the, the, the council. Mm. Um, I will have to also say a good morning to my constituents in mm. the kind of, um, and tell them that on Wednesday, God willing, we will be filing our nomination mm. for re-election. So they should they should just um, keep calm, mm. and I'm sure everything is going to be fine. Um, on the issue of um, mining or mm. illegal mining. Lamp stop. Um, I'm reading that yesterday the National Democratic Congress mm. they held a press conference somewhere in the Western region. Right, that's what I showed you. In the, in the Western region. Oh, okay, that's that's what mm. you showed. That's oh, what okay. This one is central. This is central. Oh, that, that is central. Yes. Yeah, yeah, oh, what happened yesterday was in the Western region, right? No, no, oh, this, no, this was in the region. Oh, okay. this happened that's fine. yesterday. That's fine. So that's the Pra River. That's the fine. banks of the Pra River. That's fine. And I, I, I like the fact that you also start by telling us to depoliticize mm. it mm. and discuss it and, and take a nationalistic view. Mm. Um, no, no, um, no genuine Ghanaian would tell you that um, illegal mining is, is, is having a, um, uh, it's not having a toil on, 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 on uh, for vegetation and um, um, our forest cover mm -hmm. and our environment and it's our cost of producing water and all of that. We all, we all know the effect mm -hmm. that, that illegal mining is having on us. Um, illegal mining did not start yesterday. I'm asking, have we told the people the truth? Sami raises key um, allegations. I've read paragraph 801 of yes, the budget. You yes, are in parliament. Yes, yes. Now, the things that have been said in that document, mm. what Sami alleges, what we have heard the president say, mm. today, even to the extent of putting his job on the line, mm. is not what we are seeing on the ground. Mm. I'm asking, have we told the people the truth? Because if we've not told the truth, we can't find a solution to Johnny, what we are facing. Um, in 2016, Ghana Water Company came out to warn Ghanaians mm. that if we continue the illegal mining at the speed at really what's happening then. In 2016, um, it was just a matter of time we're going to import water to drink. Right. Um, they went on to tell us that the cost of processing water mm -hmm. in their plants had gone up by sometimes four, fourfold and it was being difficult for their, their equipment mm -hmm. to keep up with the amount of um, pollution or the polluted water that they have to treat into good water for us. Mm. So you would have expected that if we had continued at that speed, maybe by 2020 today, mm. we would have been importing all the water that we drink. Mm. But it didn't happen. It took political goodwill of the president. Mm. It took the, 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 the willingness, the, 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 the commitment of a sitting president to tell Ghanaians that he was putting his presidency on the line for this illegal mining to stop. We saw how the media supported the campaign and where we got to. But did they change we anything? We will not say that we have won. Did they change anything? I, I, I am I am making my point. We are not saying that we have won the fight did against they illegal anything? I, significantly. What did, what did they change? All the things that you read from the budget. Mm -hmm. We moving from what used to or what we all know as illegal mining mm. to a sort of a regime that is legalized, that is more um, 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 regulated mm -hmm. as um, banning this whole activity at a point, mm -hmm. making sure that the, uh, our compatriots involved in the industry are trained. You mentioned the fact that 4,500 people were, were trained. Right. You mentioned the fact that 270 2,700 pieces of ammunition had been seized. Mm -hmm. Only God knows where these arms would have been if that commitment from the president had not come to sanitize what was, what was happening mm -hmm. in the industry. There were um, 85 committees in line to ensure that this was monitored. Mm -hmm. We are not saying that we, we, we have won the fight totally. It didn't take us a day or two to get to where we were mm -hmm. in 2016. And obviously, we, 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 it wouldn't take us a very short time. Mm -hmm. The commitment to fight this menace. It is what is important. And I think that the government of today, the government led by His Excellency Nana Adudankwe Kufado, has made and choked huge successes. And this is, we need continuously support mm. the government Sa in, Sami, in coming, Sami coming, says, coming, coming, Sami coming, says, coming, look, coming up with them. the conversation 
that you have had a lot of resources, a lot of support, goodwill, that you say. Mm. And yet we cannot seem to w want to punish people who have been found complicit, top government officials. That in itself is not deterring enough for anybody who today wants to get into Galamse. And that because of that, the president, who is also the co-chair for the SDGs, one of the key things is to ensure that people are living well, people are going to school, people are drinking good water and all of that, should be stripped of that position because clearly he has failed. Sami, Sami, Sami Jinfi and his ill can say whatever they want. Hmm. But the truth and the facts on the ground mm -hmm. is that um, this, 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 this talk about... Um, government officials, officials being shielded. Mm -hmm. We also saw a letter from the, the chairman of the interministerial committee to the police mm -hmm. service. When he found that, or he suspected that something had gone wrong, mm -hmm. he took the action, he reported the case to the police. Let's allow the police to do their investigations. I'm sure if we're shielding government officials and we're hiding anybody who was found culpable in this whole fight against mm -hmm. um, illegal mining, we, we wouldn't have seen a letter to the police service of uh, members of, 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 of our party and all that. We would not have been, been invited to, 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 to the police service for, for investigations. Mm -hmm. I think that a commitment is there. We will keep fighting. And as Ghanaians, we need to support the government. What kind of support is this? The, 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 support, the support comes in all forms. Like, like, for like, like now that people have been trained, anybody... Who who is 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 is, in, is, is part of this this, this regulatory regime mm -hmm. to ensure that the people who are trained do what is expected of them, whatever reporting, whatever um, um, supervision needs to go on in the industry. Mm -hmm. We all have to take that fight and take it take that fight at a nationalistic um, level. Like how, like how do you, how do you respond to the expose, the tape, the leaked mm -hmm. tape that came out? They are called a Wuzi tape that came out, for example, where they said clearly in that tape party in Yasika, you're asking for the support of the people of Ghana. And in one breath, you are telling us in a tape, top government officials, that the party needs money. How do we reconcile the two? Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me state that one. I can't vouch for the authenticity of the tape. That's, that's clear. Even if the minister or has granted. not denied the tape. Or granted. The minister has not denied or the granted. tape. The minister has not denied or the tape. Or granted. The minister and that's has what not I'm saying, granted. Tape. Okay. Granted. Right. There was nowhere on the tip that illegal mining was promoted. Okay. There was a mention of a concession which had illegally been given to someone. Mm. And going to work legally on a concession which rights has been given someone, there's nothing wrong with, with, with artisanal mining mm -hmm. or legal mining, as we know. Mm -hmm. So there is no, but nothing wrong with somebody telling somebody that, oh, Johnny has a concession, mm -hmm. and so if I need business to do, I should go on Johnny's concession mm -hmm. and work. There is absolutely nothing. nothing. It, it okay. promoted, it didn't promote any illegal mining. Mm -hmm. I think that, look, the government is committed, the interministerial committee are working, all they need is a total support of all Ghanaians, especially the media. At the height of the fight, the media took up this challenge and we, 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 we started getting results. I think that as, 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 as a people, we should continue and, and, and we should continue with, with, with where we, go, we, we, we got to and fight this menace. It's, it's to our advantage. Else future generations are going to question us. When we got opportunity, what did we do? I mean, <laughs> the NDC and, the, and its ill could go on anywhere. Is, when is, they it, got is, opportunity, is, it, is it the NDC when, and its when, ill? Look, oh, until, until, see, the, until the Environment Science and Technology and Innovation Minister, Professor Frim Pombwati, gave the bombshell on uh, multimedia, Joy FM or so, about the missing excavators. Mm. Nobody in the public knew, and yet we, we in the media, for example, were giving you all the support, but nobody knew until the minister himself, who was in charge, and had the, dropped and the, the minister, bombshell. The minister, that the minister had come to say that. How long ago did the excavators, excavators get, get missing, and why was nobody published um, um, until um, after the, the public minister, The minister had come to say that um, he had suspected some excavators were missing, mm. and he took the steps to ensure that what had gone wrong is, is corrected mm. by reporting to the police appropriately. So what is what is how long did it take? How long did it take? I mean, probably when when he realized that something had gone wrong, he had to ensure that he was getting his facts right. Okay. So as to as to whether it took a month, as to whether it took a week, mm. ultimately. 
he is taking steps to rectify what he thinks went wrong. Okay. You see, relative to what we are doing today mm. and what our 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 opponents on the other side, when they got opportunity, what did they do? If they had put in a regulatory regime like we are doing today, I am not sure we'd have gotten this far. Okay. When they got the opportunity, what did they do? They allotted these concessions to themselves. They had to take us going to court to reverse um, um, decisions like the bauxite, which, were, which was which was allotted to, to within, within themselves. All of all of, all, all of our bauxite and, and reserves and all. Of it. it took us to go to court to ensure that the writings are there. So I, I think what, what we need from them and we is their support. Sino, Sino Hydro. Oh, we gave it to Sino Hydro. Mm -hmm. But we gave it in the national interest and not in individual private people's interest. Okay. Edigi, <coughs> so Isa and his team says you're you're just muddying the waters. So give us support instead of trying to make the situation look so bad. Why are you doing that? So let's start the conversation this way. That the question that this matter should not be politicized. Mm -hmm. I want to disengage and disobey that order. Why, why not? Because if you look at our constitution, the directive principles of state policy, right. the question of maintaining the environment for the purposes of intergenerational equity among others mm -hmm. is something that is in the constitution and it is the responsibility of every citizen. Mm -hmm. So when you have a president mm -hmm. who the media have created an impression that he's in to fight the menace of Galamse. And today, the incontrovertible evidence is that he and his party, his appointees, mm. have become accomplices in the degradation of our forests and natural resource. Mm. We cannot depoliticize it. You say we created an impression? It is politics. Did we create an yes. impression? You see, the media created a mask. It was, on, it was on, the please, reality please, on the ground. Please. I'm saying that the media created a mask, mm. put it on Anado, that he's the Messiah. I am submitting to you this morning mm. that that mask is off. Nanado Danko Kufado and his appointees. Today, it has been established beyond doubt mm. that they are accomplice in this illegal mining activities. And I'll demonstrate to you. Okay. You see, you rightly read the budget statement mm. 2020. Mm. Paragraph 801. All right. Now, in that paragraph, the minister was given an update of what has happened so far. Mm -hmm. According to Minister Ken, 900 excavators were actually monitored mm. and stopped. I understand him to say, we should be in possession of these 900 excavators. Okay. Where are they? Parliament, of which my brother here is a member, mm. passed, amended the Minerals and Mining Act. Under section 90, sub, uh, you know, subsection 5, it provides you how you deal with equipment seized in illegal mining right. activities. Mm. Parliament passed that law. In the possession of the police. It says that those items be kept mm. in the possession of the Ghana police. Right. Now, now the Dan Kwe Kufa, Not perpetually. Please, please, please. Not perpetually. Please, can I proceed? For, for some time. For some please, time. Please. Not perpetually. No, he, he doesn't even know. He doesn't, he, doesn't he doesn't even know the requirement right, of law. Let's go. So your intervention is needless, please. The requirement of law is that the item become exhibit. Right. And so until due process of law, the court processes are through mm -hmm. conviction, mm -hmm. it says that you must publish in the National Gazette all the items seized okay. and do a public auction mm -hmm. under the Auction Seals Act and dispose of it, and in some instances, give it to public institutions. That's standing. Nanado Danko Ekufado and his appointees have failed to adhere to this requirement of law. And so this morning, anybody listening to us to, must know that when it comes to the fight against corruption, Nanado is beyond failure. Look, my brother, as we speak, 
we cannot trace over 2,700 ammunition and weapons seized in this fight. The, the minister says they have it. It's please, in the, please. So, uh, 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 it's allow him, it's allow him to make it. Let me, let me ask look, the questions. You see, maybe after this conversation, mm -hmm. take it up. Go back. This is a minister who cannot trace Galamse, big items. You know, uh, uh, I excavators. mean, uh, 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 excavators. Okay. Look at the size of excavator. This minister cannot trace the whereabouts of over 500. Now, we are being told there are easy, even 900 excavators. He cannot trace them. And you want him to trace where weapons are. At this point, do you still trust Minister Prof, uh, Professor Frimpong Bwati? That man, evidence had come that he is directly involved in this Galamse activity. He just says it was a concession and there's nothing wrong to have a concession. You see? You see and there was no way that uh, illegal mining was endorsed in that video. You know something? Tell me. When the audio or video combined with audio recording mm. leaked, the one who did the recording is the MPP Aguna West Constituency Chairman. It's not Eduji. Mm. Chairman Kujo Ado. Right. In the company of Ewusi, they did a video recording. In that video recording, the conversation between Ewusi and Frimpon Watin shows mm. someone in law you call partisan criminals. Mm. He knew of that criminal enterprise and in fact indicated <laughs> that he had instructed Ewusi to form a committee. Mm. And the committee were to do A, B, C, D. Oh, state, state what a committee was supposed to do. Ah, to do what a committee has done. It says, it says done. Find, find a concession, uh, put exactly. some young men together, and then find them. Please, hold please, on, hold please, on. please. Find a concession. In fact, he even yeah. goes out. He said no, he go no, 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 no. You would have your, echo, you would have echo, your, echo, your echo, echo. And then said, ah, minister, you even accompanied me to one of the sites. Atakwa. Atakwa. At that point, the minister could not rebut the claims by Echo Wusi. This is a minister. But that was, that was for youth in mining, we are told. Please! Where, I, where is that evidence? Even if you want to be the devil's advocate for this administration, where is the evidence? No such thing. And so, this administration has shown beyond doubt that when Nanado Danko Ekufuado said mm. he was putting his presidency on the line, mm. It was a it, it was the biggest deception from the here. Two boats, the pit of two hell. boats. We are told in the budget have been procured to to, to what end? Help the uh, yesterday uh, Pra River yesterday. at Bipossu and the yesterday. Cobra. Yesterday, oh, no, the I mean you have spoken. I kept so in the quiet. western region. Yesterday, you you don't believe that yesterday. The, yes, the NDC consistent with our evidence based communication took you people. You are in Accra. Mm. We took you to the site. You saw it. And you are still talking about boats. You saw the thing with your eyes, infragrantial the little. You are talking about boats. This administration operates on deception. Oh. They operate on deception because they believe that you and I, you journalists, will still be in Accra and be doing armchair journalism. So yesterday, to avoid it, we took you to the site. We are going to take you to River and Cobra. All the rivers, so you can see that in these three years, when Anado Danko Ekufado said he was putting his presidency on the line, mm. what in fact he was saying is that he wants to monopolize mm. the okay. Galamse business for you. he and his party people. No, Thank I cannot you. No, no, you, you, no, no, you gave it so no, much. No, no, it's it's equal see, time. Equal time for everybody. No, 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 it's not. It is but you see, let, me, let me say something yes. in one minute. Mm. You see, Mr. Martin Amido is becoming the biggest disappointment in terms of an office created. The only reason why Ekowusi can be this brazen, mm. can do the things that he's doing, is that, you see, we had video recorded mm. of a presidential staffer and appointee of Nana Dodanko Ekufado receiving money to sidestep rules. When this video recording, raw footage, mm. was given to Mr. Martinamidu for more than a year today, Mr. Martinamidu is here to tell the good people of this country what has become of Is it the individual or the office? He's a presidential staffer. Right. This is an individual. That, and in fact, including Chama, who to me special assistant, Andy, mm. 
His action, what the NDC did was to empower. So I can conclude. Okay. On mm. you, you, you will you come see, back to you. Johnny, we'll come back to you. Johnny. It's a where do we go from oh, you here? You gave me so much time. I am, I am monitoring you the time. I am monitoring the time. You gave me so much time. I am you gave me so much time. I am I'm monitoring the time. But well, you want me to Issa, let's go on. Oh, no, go ahead. I am reading a story on my joy online. All right. Dated on the 15th of September 2016, where the then Minister for Environment, Honorable Mama Ayaraga, it's reported as saying that minister gives up on fight against illegal mining. Okay. Wants new approach. In their time, they threw mm. their hands in the air. And they give up. Mm. And that is what cost us. That is what has brought us to the stage. That if is, they had been responsible that enough. That is what empowered the call we see and Andy and I am, I am Nana not, Galea you and see, you see that, that, was, that was a system that we put. And, and all those people, nobody has been why, found. Why do you choose to blame Whatever it on the, on the past? When you on have, the past. When because you that have, is where it started. Well, but, but when you have, that is where when it you started. Have, when you have had overwhelming media support, mm -hmm. Edujik says we created a smoke screen for, for you. I don't believe that, by the way. You have had media support. Mm -hmm. You have had interministerial committee. Mm -hmm. You have had Operation Vanguard. You have had Gallam Stop. Mm -hmm. We have invested over five hundred thousand dollars to buy drones. Mm -hmm. We have everything, mm -hmm. and the public support. And you, you know, why you do know, you why do you compare yourselves with all these arsenals to people who didn't have half of see, what you got? You see, yeah, it's it's not a matter of not having a half. When you're in government, you have the 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 the. The, the, the option to choose what is important to you as a government. Right. We have decided that this is something that we need to bring mm -hmm. under control. And okay. so we are committing state resources to ensure that right things are done within the um, artisanal mining mm -hmm. industry. And so if they didn't prioritize that, it is not our, our doing. Okay. If they didn't prioritize that, it is not where, our where doing. Do we go from we here? came, met a problem in 2017 and we didn't shy away. We have attacked the, 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 the problem headlong. Mm -hmm. We have chalked successes. If, if I you are, are rating yourself you, by, I am referring by you a hundred to what, meter stroke, what would be your percentage pass? Oh, I, I for where I sit mm. and my involvement in all of this, I, it will be difficult for me to sit No, you and, said and you have chalked successes. Oh, we have to, but if that is have, why so I, I am telling you, to assess, to I am give telling us an you assessment. that, I am telling you that if today, mm. Ghana Water at a point came to, uh, came to report mm. that, oh, uh, the cost of processing water for our households, mm. it's come down considerably because of the interventions of the government in the Ghana the water industry. is rushing water is, in the is, western region. Oh, that, that is, that is an annual... <laughs> no, an no it's, a, it's not an annual thing. I spoke with Stanley Martin. Is, no, is, hold, is, hold, hold, hold on, hold on. I spoke with Stanley Martin, mm -hmm. both on radio and on TV. He mm -hmm. says they are rationing water in the western region and, and the cost of production has gone up. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot more silt, about 40% of what they collect from the, whatever it is, rivers or whatever, is heavily silted. So they, they are spending more mm -hmm. to produce very little water. Did you, if, did you, com did you compare that? And if you don't take it, we'll be importing water. They've said it again. They've said it again. And I'm saying that from where we met this menace in 2017, what Ghana Water had reported in 2016, if, if the menace had gone on at that rate, we probably would have been importing water already So there's now. improvement. The, there is, there, that is so grade yourself we on a scale of zero to hundred. Where are we? What is your success rating? <laughs> you see, you see, you see, you see, allow me. Let's let him give you an answer. Why are you saying this is this is, this is, this for is this is this is something <laughs> that 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 will be for me for me personally. Ah. But I'm sure the people directly involved in this in the fight against uh, you don't know what your exam score is. Should be able to do it. Oh, master, what is what what I told you? I am telling you what we have been able to do, even from the point of view of Ghana Water. So between that alone, that alone should tell you that some successes. So talk. between point A, that is 2016, and when you took over in 2017 and started the fight, to 2020, you don't know what your percentage pass is. Oh, but percentage pass is 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 is, is relative. Some cases will get 90 and it's an A. Okay. Some will get 60 and it's an so A. So what have you gotten? What so have that we gotten? can decide. From what from what I say, from what I assess, mm -hmm. I think we've chalked somewhere 65, 75. 65, 70. And, see, and that is that is progressive. See, okay. when, that is progressive. When, 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 when the NDC had done that, if the NDC had done that, rather than the minister 
throwing his hands in the, in, the, uh, mm. in 2016. I'm not sure we would be discussing um, illegal money, uh, mining money this morning. Sir John, we'll, we'll who works at the Forestry yeah, Commission, I'm, I'm, is the boss there. Mm -hmm. He says there are bigger men in government than himself mm. who are behind this whole galaxy thing. Mm. It goes beyond him. Mm. And we know that some money is <laughs> going on. In he says there are bigger men behind him. And you still insist that you have chalk success. Oh, bigger men, bigger women in government, out of government, in opposition. This whole menace is being perpetrated by Ghanaians, whether wherever they stand. So it is not a matter of where they are. Mm -hmm. It is being perpetrated by Ghanaians, either fronting for foreigners and all of that. What is important is we fight this, okay. and whoever is involved is and found culpable is. And I am, I am encouraged by okay. the fact that. When Professor Fimfon Manson, uh, Fimfon Bating, Bating, right. actually actually um, suspected that there was something had gone mm -hmm. um, um, untoward, he did report to the right authorities, and we should give them the opportunity okay. to investigate right. and come out and tell us okay. where we went wrong and how we could rectify. How how, how far have we gone with the investigations? Uh, it was referred. Oh, I, I think that it's, it's it's for the police to tell us. Oh, you you why, communicate why you for me? you communicate why, for why the party. Why are you asking me where we? It's a, it's a duty of the police to come up and tell us that this is what we have done and this way. There's no status it report is, that very, you have received. I I, I, am, I am not aware of a status report, aware. so okay. it might it might be. Is okay. All right. Where do we go from here? No, by, by way of a quick <laughs> rebutter, he claims he grade his government 65%. I am just reading CTFM Online, a story by Ellen Dapa, February 14, 2020. Galamse polluted Pra River, double skin diseases and diarrhea cases in Shamar district. He said they have done better. Are you, are you situating it by this? He said they when have is done that? better. When it was that 2016? So, so, 2020 results. Okay, your 2020 <coughs> scorecard is that today skin diseases, diarrhea in mining areas has doubled. And you say you have done better. Look, you say you are mocking the people of this country. How is he doing that? I mean, Maybe in you can see the success. In the midst of this mess, mm -hmm. you have the boldness. You can't see the, the To look Ghanaians in the face and say, Nanado Danko Kufado and his men. Who have monopolized the Galamsey trade today to finance the MPP activity? Because in the words of their own party people, mm -hmm. party Hyansika. If party Hyansika, is that how you do it? You threw your hands in despair. That's what he says. That cannot be true. Ah, but that's, 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 on, what, that's what on, I just reported to you. Under the NDC, let me show you something. What happened to our the current, the current, <laughs> the current boss of Ghana Immigration Service? You know he was interdicted. Mm. He had to go to court. For the court to reinstate him, we interdicted him. Okay. For for what? <coughs> the Chinese that were coming into this country, he was interdicted. In fact, do you know the reason why the three billion Chinese facility, all the money never came? Why? Because John Mahama took a stand. What stand was that? To make sure that all the Chinese found were immediately repatriated. Over hundred. Over thousand Chinese nationals. That, that, and in no fact, no 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 there is no please, allow, allow, The Chinese allow. ambassador, the mm. lady Chinese ambassador mm. there, took offense. In fact, we changed the three billion 24 times we went to China. They took an issue with the government there. That was the policy stance. In fact, it was our fight against Galamse. Mm. That is why forced Fernando <laughs> to go to the Galamse site where he made that statement that. People are saying, me ba, me be, say Galamse, blah, 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 mm. and you're no correct. Mm. You recall, Galamse yes, invading or encroaching the Obuasi mine today. Mm. It took the NDC to stop it. You, today. You didn't jail anyone. Oh. Did you, you jail any Do you know the number Chinese? of persons we took to the courts? Did you jail any Chinese? No. Do you know the number? Of, no, John Mahama can't jail anybody. You know it. Mm. Why? The point is simple. Why couldn't he jail anybody? Allow ah, it's the, allowed. It's allowed. It's allowed me to do my that's work. That's for the judiciary. Sorry. Yes. Sorry. Immediately, John <laughs> Muhammad says he can jail someone. It means that he had usurped somebody's power. Right. But the point but, is. But he was he was the one holding them before the courts. Absolutely. And ours, so, ours is through the attorney general provide evidence in court. Okay. The rest is left. So for what was the interest of the government at the time to just arrest the foreigners and? repatriates them in fact if you are dealing with over thousand chinese nationals involved in this trade mm -hmm. the most commonsensical thing to do is repatriate it's a different scenario where you have asha one mm -hmm. who our minister 
Osaf Mabu, senior minister, comes out to say that government had to negotiate as part of the Sino Hydro deal mm. to take her back to China. That's the difference. But you see, Johnny, there's even something even more scary. Kenny which, Jebon which, has which spoken is, on mm, this matter. Mm. He said, as we speak, MPP MPs in Central Region are all involved in Galamse. Mm. That's not me saying it. That's an MPP MP. But you see, Johnny. No, 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 no. Oh, you, I'll send you the video right after no, no, this no, no, program. No, no. But I'll send it to you. No, but it's true because he said, it is, it is, he said it can his own colleague, MPP it can MPs, be are involved be in Galamse uh, uh, in the let's, central let's, region. Let's raise the argument. But you it see, can, can Johnny, be. even more important, we were thinking that Nanado Dankwe Kufado said 2020 will be a year of rules, right? right? Right. We never knew that it's going to be a year of return of excavators. And that is the regrettable position we find ourselves. You can't see the roads. Where are the, the roads, roads are coming oh, come, please, come to please. my constituency. And you know, the roads, there is there's no road in your area that starts being Come to my constituency. You come and see the roads. The roads are that I told you. Is there no road in your area that's nowhere? I'll deal with that road. Okay. You see, I told you about the media mm. and how the media had created a certain mask on Nanado mm. and why that mask is up today. You know Nanado is the co-chair. Who pulled it off? I mean, his deceptive leadership. Who pulled the mask off? Ghanaians. Okay. We can see now. You know, he's the co-chair of the SDG implementation right. and whatever. Critical with this had to do with protecting the environment. Mm. The scorecard for Nanado Dankwe Gufado in Ghana today is the nature of the river. What will be your scorecard? It's as a 65. For Nanado? Yes. I told you that the man is beyond F. Failure. <laughs> Nothing more failure. But you see, you'd expect him to only fail. But he has added corruption to this. And you know why? See, Martin Amidu, Martin Amidu is becoming a huge disappointment for this country. All because the minister had come to the conclusion mm. that a journalist had created an account in NIB. Right, a former PCP journalist. Yes, journalism. was receiving 50,000, 55,000. An appointee of Nanado Dankwe Kufado in the person of one of mm. who is the national security coordinator in Central Region, is the recipient of this money and he shares it among oppression Galamso people. That evidence was given. You know what Frimpon Watson did? No. That's corruption. He decided to give it to the CID because he knows the CID will cover uh. up and provide the small screen that was provided for Charles So what, what, should it, what should it happen? You pass under you. No, hold on. What should, what should, should, shouldn't the matter have been referred to the police? Shouldn't no, have referred no, to the like, matter, I, I, no, not the police. Shouldn't the matter have been you referred to the police? You pass the Office of the Special Prosecutors Act right. and provide it under Section 70. Mm -hmm. It's jurisdiction. But the man has said that, that look, what is he doesn't jurisdiction? have he doesn't what is have the jurisdiction hold on. of the OSP. Oh, but it's Tell bribery, bribery, but, bribery and corruption. But the man has you said, gave it. In but fact, you has from, said no, they took that particular offense mm. from the criminal offenses act and gave it to But Martinamidu has said that look, I look, I, I don't have the things I need to be able to see, deal with see, the issues. You see. He said it. Our, that's exactly, has he not said it? That's exactly the point I gave you. That our president mm. speaks one way and his body language is in another direction. In that, he tells you that, oh, I've created an office of special prosecutor and he stabs the man. Ask him, as a member of uh, the finance committee, you gave the man 180 million allocation. allocation right. Ask him how much had been released. How much was released? So far, the last time Martin Amidu spoke to David, mm. You know David? Yes, David Ampofo. He complained. What and date, what date was that interview? Oh, that was just... That was before, that was that was before the 180. Year. Yes, no, that was no, before it's the not. allocation of 180 to the office. And, and subsequently, Martin that, Amidu, the whole office complex is being put at this place. Please, please, please. So what's what it? And that is why... Let, let's get the figures. Isa, how much was given to... I, I, one it, he doesn't even know. know. As a member... No, no, no. He said it would be difficult at this point. Do you expect me to have all the figures? All the figures on the head. It's a special office created by you guys. So at least you should know... Created by the new patriotic party, not you guys. Very well. But you are a member of parliament. Yes, But the point I'm making is that... Frimpo Bwati knows... Okay. Wrap up for me. So Isa can have the final part. Imagine do corruption-based investigation... May as well even expose the president. So he prefers giving it to Ken Yeboa mm -hmm. at the CID headquarters and the police to do the very work that was done. How come the police cleared Charles Bissu? 
whilst Martin Amidu is still investigating that matter. So this whole business of the MPP, Nanado Danko Ekufado, having fought Galamsi, mm. is a deception, is a lie, it had never happened. The situation is even worse mm. than the MPP inherited. Okay, thank you. Let Isa, me, take me, a final let bite. Me, let, me, let, me, let me make a point that uh, we are not going to be dissuaded by what our, our brothers on the other side are saying about this. You are focused. Um, we, are, we are focused. We are on resolute. The oh, no, no. We are He's resolute. Uh, allow him? We, are, we are bringing sanity and, 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 and some confidence back into the mining industry. Mm -hmm. You know what happened to Anglo Gold right. under the NDC? A mm -hmm. couple of um, days ago, the president was there to see the first gold after the restructuring of Anglo Gold. Back that, is, again, that, is, that is what we are doing. It is now a, a company that is not being threatened by illegal um, mining as mm -hmm. happened under them. Um, under the NDC, under the NDC, we saw the Minister of Environment mm -hmm. come come out to throw his hands in the air to say that ah he's giving up on the fight. We are not give, going to give up. He on said the they fight. didn't do we that. We are going to. Oh, but that that's I gave they you a date. Over I gave Chinese you I gave people. you I gave you a date Even on the sixth of June. I gave you a date. I gave you a date on which I gave you a date on which my joy online reported that sorry on the sixth of June, twenty sixteen, Honorable Minister. Uh, Mama Ayarga, right. I thrown his hands in the air and said, oh, we, we have given up because we cannot see, fight. They had all the state apparatus at their disposal, mm -hmm. including what the section he read of the constitution, uh, the, what, whatever, uh, uh, giving them uh, a, a government, a government all, the, all the, if they had prioritized, mm -hmm. if they had taken a step, if they had the fought the menace, I am no, I'm not, I'm not sure that we will be here. <laughs> okay. The scavengers be missing. It's neither here nor there. Is it, is the, it minister, it the minister, the minister says, the minister no, no, says, that, allow me. The minister says that he suspects, he has suspicion. The, the finance minister says nine hundred. Yes, no, he, he said minister, that. He said nine hundred. I mean, John, you just read this. Yes. So why are you distorting this? Okay, I'm not distorting. You no, just no. read. It. He said. Yes, he said they are monitored and tracked. Yes. And monitored and tracked. It is not said as lost. Arrested. Read, read, read that so, statement. So, this is the Allow me. Allow me. Allow me. Allow me. Yeah, please. Allow me. It says, read, read that, read that monitored and tracked 900 excavators used in mining operations, leading to the arrest and deportation of 139 Chinese illegal miners. So, where in line? Well, he said 900 excavators have, have been, been monitored, monitored and tracked. For what purpose? So, what is, of course, to, to, to sanitize the, the industry. Okay. Whether or not it was illegal or, or legal, artisanal mining, they will use excavators. But, but the figure, so the figure 500 had, that was quoted by the media has hmm. been disputed by many of your party people. People. Yes, nobody has given us the official oh, figures. Oh, I am, I am. Do you I know am, the official figures of okay, okay, excavators? I've asked you, I've asked you six Johnny, questions of yeah, figures. Johnny. Hold on for no, me. No, you yeah. started with oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, but you have had time to. No, you have had so much time. Oh, you want me to give you, give you my time as well? See, it's I've asked you six questions based on figures, and you are not giving me one. Yes, but but the minister. Who is the chair of the interministerial committee fighting this menace? Says 500. And you want okay. me to dispute it? But the, your party people are disputing it. My party people? Yes. yes. There are a lot of them they who are, are on air or social yes, media. Yes, I am sure that. I am sure that. They are disputing this and calling the oh, media dishonest. Oh, how, yes. how is that? Oh, they, they are. How yeah, is maybe I'm not checking social that? media. Who are, who they, are, that? they are calling. They say the media doesn't see, have facts. We see. just report. You see, uh, a colleague MP. Mm. So, has so let's 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 see. Okay. Let's see. Let's see how this is. Let's see how this is. I, I, I thought I was talking. Oh, no, no, I will tell that time is up. Sorry about that. You know, as we speak, only 5.6 million mm. Ghana cities had been released out of 180 million to Mr. Martin Abbey. That was in last but year's see, budget. But you see, as for 2020, we are not even there How yet. How, we not how, how does the, the complex, you see, office complex you see, is given but you see, fit into that? There's something important, and that goes to the scorecard. I'll okay. Just, I'll read and then we go. Our time is up. In the last three years, skin diseases have increased dramatically. You have read that already. From 5,000 cases yeah, no, to 10,000. You have read, read, read that already. That's not a good scorecard. Uh, that's not a good scorecard. He's also a member of the RDC's communication team. I am sure this morning you would have been drinking uh, important water from the RDC. And Issa Hussaini is the honorable member of parliament for the Okaraku World Constituency. Thank you very much for watching.